Welcome to the Netherlands, a land where majestic windmills spin, vibrant tulips bloom, and the sky embraces the tallest people on earth. The Netherlands, also known as Holland, is situated in northwestern Europe. It is bordered by the North Sea coast to the west of Germany, covering a total area of 41,543 square kilometers. It boasts a coastline that stretches 451 kilometers. As a result, it ranks as the 22nd smallest country in Europe and the 135th smallest in the world. As of the end of May 2023, the Netherlands had a population of 17,861,351 people. Notably, the Dutch are renowned for their impressive height, making them the tallest people in the world. On average, Dutchmen stands at an impressive height of 6 feet 0.5 inches, while Dutch women boast an average height of 5 feet 7.5 inches. One of the remarkable aspects of the Netherlands is its multicultural society. Dutch people are known for their tolerance and acceptance, embracing diversity and fostering a spirit of inclusivity. With a global outlook, the Netherlands has become a melting pot of cultures, making it a vibrant and welcoming place to live. Dutch people are known for their directness and honesty. They value open and frank communication and tend to be straightforward in their conversations. This cultural trait is often referred to as Dutch directness. The Netherlands boasts a remarkable past filled with triumphs and struggles. During the 17th century, known as the Dutch Golden Age, the country established itself as a global maritime power. It was during this time that Amsterdam became the world's leading center for trade, art, and science. Windmills, an iconic symbol of the Netherlands, stand as majestic structures that not only adorn the countryside, but also encapsulate tales of resilience and innovation. With over 1,000 windmills gracing its landscape, the Netherlands proudly claims them as part of its heritage, originally serving the purpose of draining water from the land. In the picturesque village of Kinderdijk, we find a UNESCO World Heritage Site that hosts 19 authentic windmills. These marvels of engineering were constructed in the 18th century to reclaim and drain the surrounding wetlands. Another emblem of the Netherlands is the tulip, renowned for its vibrant colors and delicate beauty. During the 17th century, the Dutch experienced tulip mania, an extraordinary economic bubble. At the height of this craze, tulip bulbs were more valuable than gold, leading to exorbitant prices and, eventually, a dramatic market crash. Nevertheless, the tulip has remained an enduring symbol of the Netherlands. The Netherlands is home to the largest flower auction in the world, Alsmeer Flower Auction. Spanning an astonishing 363 acres, this bustling marketplace processes millions of flowers each day. From tulips to roses, this hidden hub plays a vital role in the global flower trade, connecting growers and buyers from every corner of the planet. The Dutch are known for their love of horticulture and gardening. The country is home to the world's largest flower garden, Kuchenhof, which showcases millions of colorful blooms each year. The Netherlands is also famous for its exceptional cheese, including Gouda and Edam. With diverse flavors and textures, Dutch cheeses cater to various preferences. Cheese markets offer delightful experiences, showcasing traditional rituals and artisanal varieties. The country upholds strict quality standards and exports its renowned cheeses worldwide, earning its status as a cheese paradise. Water is deeply intertwined with Dutch culture, 
The Netherlands is renowned for its intricate canal network which served as transportation routes in the past and shaped the country's identity. With approximately one quarter of its territory lying below sea level, the Dutch are pioneers in hydraulic engineering, developing innovative methods to reclaim land and protect against flooding. They even have a unique system called poldering. As we op the deck staan, dan zien we aan de ene kant het water van het IJsselmeer en aan de andere kant land, zover het oog reikt. En het kost moeite je te realiseren dat ook hier nog niet zo lang geleden het water van de zee golfde. Dat hier schepen voeren. De grote machines van het gemaal Wurtman alleen al slaan per minuut anderhalf miljoen liter water naar buiten. Het waterpeil in de polder is sedert het begin van de droogmaling dan ook al ruim een meter gezakt. En intussen pompen de drie gemalen onafgebroken door. Through this process, the Dutch expanded their landmass by draining water from areas and creating new land known as polders. About 17% of the country's territory is reclaimed land. The Netherlands is known for its excellent water quality. The country has strict regulations and rigorous monitoring systems in place to ensure that its tap water is among the cleanest and safest in the world. As a result, many Dutch people prefer drinking tap water over bottled water. Amsterdam, the capital city of the Netherlands, is built on a system of canals and it has more canals than Venice. The city's canal belt, known as the Grachtengordel, is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and a beautiful example of urban planning. When it comes to sustainable urban planning and design, the Netherlands stands out as a global leader. Rotterdam, in particular, stands out for its innovative architecture and sustainable infrastructure. It is home to iconic structures like the Markthal, a sustainable residential and market building shaped like a horseshoe. The Port of Rotterdam, located in the Netherlands, proudly claims the title of the world's largest port. It is a major hub for international trade and shipping, handling goods and cargo from all around the world. Bicycles are ubiquitous in the Netherlands with a well-maintained cycling path network. Cycling is not just a mode of transportation, but a way of life, promoting a healthy lifestyle and sustainable mobility. Remarkably, there are more bicycles in the Netherlands than people, with an estimated 18 million bicycles and 17 million people. The Dutch are passionate about soccer. Despite being a relatively small country, the Netherlands has produced numerous successful football players and has a strong footballing tradition. The national team, known as the Orange, has achieved significant success on the international stage. Throughout the year, the Netherlands comes alive with vibrant festivals and celebrations. One of the most famous is King's Day, or Koningsdag, a nationwide party held on April 27th, the birthday of King Willem Alexander. On this day, the entire country dresses in the royal color orange and takes to the streets for music, parades, flea markets, concerts, and lively festivities. Birthdays hold significant importance for the Dutch. Traditionally, when it is someone's birthday in the Netherlands, they are responsible for treating their friends, family and colleagues to treats like pastries or snacks. This custom is known as tractorin. Herring holds a special place in the hearts of the Dutch. Raw herring, called haring, is a popular snack in the Netherlands. Traditionally, it is eaten by holding the fish by the tail and taking a bite from the top often accompanied by chopped onions and pickles. The Netherlands is considered one of the most LGBTQ plus friendly countries in the world. The country was the first to legalize same-sex marriage in 2001 and has since been at the forefront of LGBTQ plus rights, promoting inclusivity and equality. 
country's thriving art scene is another highlight with world-class museums such as the Rijksmuseum and the Van Gogh Museum preserving and showcasing the country's artistic heritage. These institutions preserve and showcase the country's artistic heritage, showcasing the beauty and creativity of Dutch culture. Thank you.